Hello YouTube, I'm David with the David West channel. Well today is Labor Day, it's Monday. Got a few sprinkles falling out of the sky, 9.30 in the morning. I still have to go walk. But before I go, I wanted to practice a little fire making. And I want to do a little survey today. Please comment and let me know if you practice fire making every day like me, or just exactly what your frequency is. Once a week, once a month. I have like at least a thousand or more views per video. So there's a lot of people interested in fire making and fire making techniques. That'll be interesting to see how many of them and how often they practice every day. Let's go ahead and use the keychain ferro rod today. This is three and an eighth inches by five sixteenths. It's a Bayite. You buy them on Amazon for about a three pack for about uh, $13. Half of that is shipping. I think the little Bayite is the best, the best brand of ferro rod. Um, Loblolly pine needles. These are particularly dry. Don't have a lot of sap left in them. The Loblolly pine needle, uh, when they're dry, the needles are twisted. And the average length is between five and seven inches. And they come in bundles of three. Really, really great for tinder, as you've seen over and over and over again. I like to break them down a little bit. Not too much, not too little. And put just a little bit of a hole right in the center. Now you're not going to get one strike ignites with such a small ferro rod. Sometimes if the pine needles are soft and have a lot of resin in them, you can one strike ignite all day long. But these, I'm not expecting that. I'm expecting two or three strikes to ignite these. I don't believe in wasting your first scrape on a ferro rod. I don't care how much corrosion is on there or oxidation or how much paint is on there. On the back side of those scrapings where you, you know, you're trying to scrape off the oxidation, on the back side of that are some good scrapings that will ignite. So why not put them down in the tinder bundle even though you know they're not gonna spark? Because when you do get a spark, then they'll ignite. And of course, my favorite, my everyday carry, Stanley 10 049. All right, y'all. Appreciate you joining me on this one. We'll catch you on the next one.